Hey YouTube, welcome to the Monday Night Raw review from January 22nd of 2013. The other video that I made yesterday is going to be delete deleted because I made a mistake. So, so we're reviewing the um, Monday Night Raw of January 21st. The final wall before the Royal Rumble. As the hit between The Rock and Pierre Punk continues, we, this time we tap the, the, with the clock matches. And I will introduce a new segment that will be every week a power ranking according to from January 19th of 2013. Let's just turn, shall we? Well, first off, the first segment of tonight is <coughs> Vicky Paul Heyman and of course The Rock and the police officer. Now, Vicky was offended because of The Rock on to with The Rock that we lost. He was horrible tonight. But she had the um and she had the Dan Dan Jose police stop the rock. And Vicky Blessing that if the rock showed up at the arena, the, the police had gonna arrest the rock. Sorry. So we go to our first um beat the class mask which was trying to memorize it. Randy Orton versus Antonio that uh, versus the United States champion Antonio. If Randy Orton win with an RKO out of nowhere. And the time to be was eleven thirty five. And then we go to the Divas match, which is a short match, case on one to the Divas champion, but I say more. And there was a bunch of short matches too. And in the new Hall of Fame inductee that was announced yesterday, his name is. Damn it. Hold on. What's his name? Bob Backlund <coughs> announced at WWE Hall of Fame 2013 inductee. So, pretty soon I'm going to do the power ranking. <coughs> So the problem is at 11.35 to the opening, um, the MIA versus Dolph Diggler. And Dolph Diggler win with 10 minutes and 25 seconds. Now that was that took a time. <coughs> and the last beat the clock match with a shameless but with Wade Barrett. <coughs> and of course, I finished that with Dolph Diggler, AJ Lee, and NXT champion, Bade A. Langston, or Fly Black, or Clock Langston. <coughs> now, then, um, Big A. Langston. Now, then AJ Lee, beat a Langston, and Dolph Taylor came down. It was a little trouble because they didn't want Jameis or Ray Barris to beat the time. Did they win? No. Did they lose? No. 
Because I leave in no contest because of how I ran out. I'd seen it. Landed the blow kick. Now onto the short matches. Right back, first day, he's later. Right back, one, cross match. <coughs> Big Show versus Death Rider. Big Show win. Cross match. <coughs> Hold on. <coughs> um, Team Hell No. Right away from any man's mind, a pretty good thing went there. And he wanted everybody to hug. Yes, I even hugged myself. I did. Uh, let's see. And there was a little promo with the rock. And, um, Paul Heyman came out. I wanted to give a little Paul bomb, but it was interrupted by the great one. He went on stage and he had a ticket. A ticket. On the stage. So let me get this straight. <coughs> if you buy a ticket, you're most likely to be in the ring. That's sarcasm. But if I had an idea, and that was an idea. They can't arrest him <coughs> if he buys a ticket, so. And The Rock did a pretty, great, pretty good promo. It's a real good promo there. Like, like aggressive. Since 1998. Um. And as soon as Rock was finished with his promo, <coughs> his shield came out. Even the Rock cousin, Roman Ring, did the triple power bomb. Now, and then he did it, <coughs> and he ended up having a bloody lip, having up blood. Now, um, then John Dino came out to do his promo, and then more people came, more people, more people, more people, more people, more people, <coughs> until it ended up being a brawl. Now, we do our first Now we introduce the, the new segment named Power Ranking. So we are top 25. Starting from number 25, Tensai. In number 24, 
Previously with number 23, AJ Lee. Previously from previously ranking number 22 and now 23, R Truth. Ranking number 2, Dentino Morella. Ranking number 21, Dash Rider. Again, this is from January 19th from SmackDown. So, bear with me on it. I could be updated for this every week. Ranking number 20, surprisingly, 3MB. Uh, number 19, The Shield. The, the Shield. That's Roland, Dean Ambrose, and Roman Reigns. Number 18, Grace Carly. <coughs> Number, ranking at number 17, Kofi Kinsland. <coughs> number, ranking number 26, The Eustos, or Rikichi Stun. We go on to number 20, we go on to number 15. Ranking at number 15, Brodus Clay. Ranking <coughs> at number 14, Big Show, the Big Show. Ranking number 13, Team Road Stallers. <coughs> Ranking number 5, Dolph Diggler. <coughs> Ranking number 11, Caitlin. Ranking number 10, hold on, it's loading up. Okay. Ranking number 10, Antonio's Gas. Antonio's Gas. Arrow. <coughs> That's Arrow. Ranking is number 9, Wade Barrett. <coughs> anyway, ranking is number 8, Randy Orton. <coughs> ranking is number 7, The Mears. Ranking is number 6, Team Hell No. Now we go on to number five. Why back? Why he number five? <coughs> Why back? Has made his day. May have made his day Monday night on the twentieth anniversary of Raw, helping Miss Foley out when his shield attack, playing ring an activity for the monster superstars that won five this week. The ranking number four is your world heavyweight champion, Alberto Del Rio. Why? New world heavyweight champion continues his climb up the power ranking ladder. Enjoy a tag team victory over Beach Show and Dolph Ziggler in a massive smashdown main event. Ranking number three, Seamus. By the tag team win with the World Heavyweight Champion Alberto Del Rio in SmackDown, the Dr. Royal dropped a spot after coming up short in his bid against 3MB in an over the top rope challenge Monday night on the 20th anniversary of Raw. Number 2, John Cena.
Later, we have to pass on the power and clean up a huge victory over Mr. Money in the bank of the club on the 20th anniversary of Raw. You know, Dina Brutal still carried victory to fight the odds. And listen to the show of himself, both H.H. Lee and Bates E. Langston had to dice that on, uh, on adding a mark to Dina Lost column. And now, who is number one? Who's number one? Hmm? Who's number one? I'll tell you who's number one. He is the best in the world. The WWE champion, the Empire. The WWE champion has been to get the respect of the Academy of Wrestling Arts and Science at CM Punk hold on to the top spot this week. Punk's victory over a clearly angry British Slay on the 20th anniversary of Raw once again proved that even if he's outside, the champ is still capable of putting knees to faces. So that's the power ranking. Subscribe for more videos. I'll be doing this every week along with the power ranking. So, you should watch the Royal Rumble done this Sunday. And well, we'll see how everything goes.